Welcome to Well's Quick Tips and Trick YouTube Cooking Channel and today I am going to show you how to make Shipu uh, or in English it is called Dil uh, Paratha and this is Dil that is Shipu it looks like this okay so I have taken two cups of Ashirwad wheat atta you can use any any of yours and I've taken around uh, one bunch of uh, shipu that is uh, in English dill uh, and chopped it finely okay so I will be adding this into this and the other dry ingredients I will show you now so here I'm going to use this now in this so add this in the wheat flour then I'm using two chilies you can use one chili according to your spiciness you can use more uh, finely chopped one then we will add our lime juice to this So one lime juice salt to taste masala to this so here is come around half teaspoon of turmeric powder a pinch of chili powder and around one teaspoon of coriander powder that's it i'm going to use no more other masalas for this you can use your uh, chicken masala or your homemade garam masala if you want you can use it if you are using garam masala, then see that you don't add any uh, other than uh, that. Don't use any other uh, chilies and all. It will turn out otherwise spicy. And let's add our soy to this. And knead it. Okay, kneading part is, everybody knows kneading by now. Some salt to taste. So I have used approx like one teaspoon, but you can check the salt and now mix all this together. Don't add water first because the vegetable itself has water. So first you try to mix all this. Then you add slowly by slowly water and knead the flour. Add how much you need but add it very slowly by slowly. If you are not experienced then add step by step. So this is like 2 cups of flour. Now we can add salt, uh, so, sorry, we can add uh, oil to this, like around 1 to 2 teaspoon of oil to this. Or you can use your ghee. And again, 
knead a little while then roll it and fry it So here it is and now I will make a small ball and frying procedure and rolling procedure is same. So take one dry flour and just roll this don't worry about the shapes and all So here it is. And we will fry this. add some ghee to this so now here it comes and we will add some ghee to this and it's done it and now we will add our ghee to this so you can be gracious with the ghee or you can be stingy with the ghee like depending upon how much you like stingy because of health conscious fry nicely both the sides Here it is nicely fried, you can see. So hope you will enjoy this uh, Shipu uh, ka paratha. And do let me know how it is in the comment box. Thank you so much.